in this video we are going to discuss about microbes now what are microbes microbes are living organisms around us which cannot be seen with naked eyes a naked eye here the term naked eye we are going to come across several time in this video so what does naked eye means here since this is the topic of microbes now microbes are those organisms which is not possible to see without lens now these lenses are of special type like magnifying glass high power of lenses needed to see these kind of organisms microscope and magnifying glass are one of those the second line says these microbes can only be seen through microscope since the word itself indicates micro meaning very small thus can be seen only through an instrument called microscope microscope is an instrument used to see those organisms which we cannot see with naked eye classification of microbes the major group of microbes are bacteria protozoa some fungi and some algae a topic is bacteria let me tell you the first thing that the main microbes or microorganisms responsible for the contamination of food are bacteria bacteria are present everywhere they are found even inside and outside of our body they are made up of only one cell now some bacteria need oxygen for respiration some bacteria needs oxygen for respiration they are called aerobic bacteria and some other do not need oxygen they are called anaerobic bacteria on the basis of their shape and size they are categorized into different types such as rod shaped known as bacillus spherical shaped known as cocci spiral shaped known as spirilli and comma shaped known as vibrio now bacteria multiply rapidly by the process of fission protozoa like bacteria they are the most single cell or unicellular organisms amoeba paramecium and euglena a few examples of protozoans euglena shows the feature of both plant and animals like bacteria they also multiply by the process of fission so what happens that mostly single cell or unicellular organisms are here means either it is going to be single cell organism or unicellular more than one cell but this now like i said that euglena shows the feature of both plant and animals euglena is having both the feature it's neither plant nor animal it's it's in neither plant category nor in animal but in both since it shows both the feature fungi is a special group earlier it was called non green plants but this group has some specific characters different from both plant and animals yeast molds and mushrooms are examples of fungi all fungi are not microscopic bread molds aspergillus neurospora and penicillium are some microfungi now a fungus is one of a wide range of living organism some of them are also beneficial to health but why this is not characterized as a plant and animal okay this is because it is mode of heterotrophic nutrition it does not make their own food it takes the help
of other sources like plant is capable green plant is capable of making their own food by the help of sunlight air water but what does fungi do what does fungus do they make their food by that or algae now algae are very tiny plants you are going to mostly find it in water because it's live in water they are the simplest plants and possesses chlorophyll you can uh, commonly you can find algae anywhere like uh, sometimes you can find in old walls some green on a layer of greenish small small leaves you are going to see it's algae they are the simplest plant and possesses chlorophyll yes it is capable of possessing chlorophyll some algae are microscopic whereas other can be seen through naked eye as beforehand i told in fungus that some of them were microscopic whereas some of them you can see naked eye yes in algae also you are going to find the same thing you can see some of the algae through naked eye but some of them it is not possible to see through naked eye you need some uh, magnifying glass or microscope to view similarly some algae are unicellular such as chlorella and chlamydomonas whereas some are multicellular such as spirogyra the the algal body is relatively undifferentiated and there are no true roots or leaves means like other plants you are not going to find any kind of roots in algae one definition is that algae have chlorophyll as their primary photosynthetic pigment and lack of sterile covering of cells around their reproductive cells 